Daniva, are you a her or a him, daughter? I'm going to say that, but I'm sorry. Daniva, are you a her or she wants to know, are you a her or a him? Walk over here and show them, are you a her, Daniva? Let me put my pants down, then. Are you a her? <laughs> but listen, it, like, I think, I think, honestly. So, Funky Daniva is a woman. Quentin Q, who you okay, talking to well, right now? Like Funky Dyneema is a her. Q, who you talking to right Funky now? Dineva. Is all man. You. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah. I may not be a lady, <laughs> but I'm all woman. Right. Dyneema, take my down here. No, no. Oh. All right. Tamar, read it. Scroll back. What she said? She said, she said, what did you say about her being molested? I didn't say nothing yeah. bad about that um, tired ass bitch being molested. I actually comment, I actually supported you in that and got very serious in it since you around here with your ashy ass friends saying, what the fuck, yo, not need big leg up. Uh, I ain't never gonna do that with her. Not me, but. I'm not looking. She's the one coming at me sideways. I didn't say anything bad about her being molested. I was in support of her. So wh whoever calling her, telling her to get on the line and she getting on here doing this dumb ass shit that she always do, they end up getting her read by me. She need to go back and look at it. I didn't say anything. While I've let, one thing about it, baby, I got a soul. I would never say anything dirty about somebody getting molested. I read Iyanla on your behalf, Tamar, and supported you, Tamar. So on this same thread, your ass need to go through there and write, oh, I'm sorry, girl, let me go back and watch the show. Oh, Lord Jesus. You want to come back, bro? No. Okay. She's so late. I need to go back and see what you said. You shouldn't have said nothing. I said something. See, yeah, now I shouldn't have said nothing, girl. If anything, I read that damn Nigerian. Now, get on me about that. That's what I read. You can't even support a hoe. You can't even support these hoes. You say something positive and support of them and they get on a damn thread. You would think somebody as popular as her and own it. Shouldn't she be in the studio somewhere making love and war or something? <laughs> Helping Tracy film and run Braxton Family Values or something. You can't even say nothing positive. I didn't say anything negative, Tamar. That's the sad part. You so quick to jump into some damn shit. I was, I was supporting you. As an artist and as a woman who went through that was 100% positive. Didn't say anything negative. But now I'm the ashy friend. That's your friend. Oh, Lord. <laughs> All up in the thread. You can't even say nothing positive about these bitches. Did I say anything negative about her that molestation? Was 100% positive. Love I gotta go. I'm gonna go watch it. Was 100% positive. Because we did. Got serious about it and said, whoa, this was wrong. No, was I'm positive. sorry this happened. It was 100% positive. positive. Yeah, but that's the shit she do. And she wonder why don't nobody fuck with her like her. That's the shit she do. You can't even say nothing positive in support of the bitch. That's true. I didn't do anything wrong. I don't, I don't feel no way it's tied. Even in support, you can't even support a bitch. But I'm the ashy friend. Let's take a call her. But she, she the friend with high blood pressure because her knees and her calf and her ankle the same fucking size. Bitch, go get your blood pressure together. <laughs> I'm gonna go to bed, child. I'm tired. I so don't have time for Baldine. <laughs> <laughs> On that note, bye, bitch. Be a, Jesus, be a water pill. <laughs> I can't. I can't never win for losing. <laughs> Tonight, 
Oh, I mean, oh, um, yes, you did, Zanibu. Because I said this early before we even started talking about this. Hold on, Jamel. I said this before we even started talking about I said, I don't want to touch none of that stuff. I said this early. I said, I want to get into that because I know that y'all got a history with each other. But we really don't. We really don't have a real history. I don't know that lady. Of course, I blog. Of course, I say my little snide comments in the blog. It ain't nothing like that. I lose no secret. But I don't even know this lady. Me and her exchanged a few words on Twitter years ago. It ain't nothing. It ain't nothing. It ain't nothing. I love her as an artist. What that was she just did, whatever little piece of misinformation she just got, and she coming on here running her damn mouth. You can't even support a bitch. And shit that they don't put out in the media. Now I'm the ashy friend, this, that, and the third. And I was nothing but positive and in support of. But that's the thing. She keep, I don't know who the fuck don't got in her. Oh, that never said, that never said. Now she running, ain't even seen the damn show. All that what she just did was premature. But I'm cool because she going to look back at it and look stupid. And when this hit the blogs in the morning for her being premature and looking stupid, she'll regret it. Then she'll go somewhere and play victim like she do, like somebody done did. That's the bitch back. It's 1 o'clock in the morning. Finish my cocktail and go beat my meat and go to sleep, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Don't leave no stains in the bed, girl. She need to be down to see a side of us. She need to be down to see a side of us. Sign of her name on the guest list with a mask over her face, praying over Vix. Okay, that's what the fuck she need to be doing. Y'all done read. Uh, Y'all done read. Now, damn. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all done read. 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 I can't, I never could win. Jane said the laughing while talking about the molestation subject was wrong. It's a touchy subject. That mean, but that's what. That we were not laughing. I didn't laugh. No one laughed. There was nothing funny about that. We laughed at other things around it. Whatever. God knew me for my intentions. I would never laugh about that. And, 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 and I'm big enough to say this to Tamar who was watching. If in any way I offended you or it's been implied or you feel, you know, some kind of way about it, I sincerely apologize. That's not funny. That was a very vulnerable moment that you had. When Finish. Uh okay, so I'm going to do the Queen's uh, Supreme Court review and recap but i wanted y'all to hear the after show right and i'm telling y'all every time i try to like that lady that lady do something crazy i'm like what was she watching she couldn't have been watching the same show that i was watching but from what i understand or what it sounds like is that james was watching the show you know um james chanel right? Is that his name? And I only call him Chanel. I don't know if they call him that for real, but the reason why they say Chanel is because he sang the Patty Pies song and that's how he gained momentum on social media. But he sang the uh, Patty, Patty LaBelle Pies and all she got him was a purse. Now it was old good runway Chanel. It wasn't no, well, no Chanel is regular. To be quite honest, I have never owned a Chanel that was less than, shit, 1300 So, <clears throat> at any rate, I want y'all to tell me if you thought that Funky Dineva was wrong. I don't think he was wrong. I don't think he said anything ugly about the situation, you know, that she spoke on on the Wendy show. Now, him going in on her being widowed, scamming or what he claimed to be a scam in Nigerian, that may be, you know, what she felt touchy about. But because she probably couldn't, I don't know, I don't know. Because she couldn't get 
mad about the molestation thing, she probably had misdirected anger towards the wrong subject because she probably was in her feelings about somebody calling her Nigerian a scammer. That's what I think, you know. So put it below if you think that Funky Dineva was being disrespectful. Talk to you guys later.